What happens if you Huskar ulti someone that's linked? Do they just both take the damage? Where does Huskar fly? Yeah, I think that he flies to the first target, but they both take the damage, I think. Seems good. Yeah, does Huskar take the da does Huskar take damage twice or once? I don't know. I think we'll it find out. Take damage twice. For this is a very good life stealer game. With the, I mean, they have DP and bat for him. He kind of rolls over Chen and Nyx. And he's a lot of people think Sven is good against life stealer. I don't know. I'm not convinced. Life stealer can s sustain against Sven's damage, and then later in the game, it becomes kind of hard for Sven. But Sven can't farm a lot faster than him. It's like the same thing with this modern Dota. It's all about just like getting ahead. Everyone's like played like an alchemist in this one. It's like, what matchup can I play where my hero just gets like three items ahead of their hero? It's kind of weird. Okay, it makes traditional counters less impactful. It's like lane swapping. Is getting countered if I have more items than you. Radiance lane swapping. It looks like Dyer is also lane swapping. Scowl gonna just do it late. It makes sense because he's a Chen. They sending Polo solo top. I think Chen's gonna walk top. Yeah, Chen's tracking. Yeah, they want this bat versus Doom. Pretty nice for bat. However, Life Stealer doesn't mind laning against Fen. That's that's what they wanted. They wanted Sven against Life Stealer. It's the bat matchup is what they're more interested in. Yeah. That kind of rolls Doom. Uh, Life Stealer's already trekking again. Yeah. Uh -huh. This can't be worth it. They are both walking. Dude's walking up too. Wow. Yeah. Oh, uh, I think he's going I back. They have now lost lanes. Oh, this is a cool game. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. I think. Other team uh, is good, though, it definitely, to be. definitely sucks for them. But they're, I mean, they're gonna be a level behind, but they're gonna get the lanes they want. Right? So, yeah. So. It's not like the worst, right? The support gets a bit of... Gets to soak the XP. So this Witch Doctor is dangerous territory. That's two. <laughs> He's like uh, six napalm uh, stack. Uh, that's uh, that's uh, level two. That was really questionable. This seems supposed to be good. <laughs> they have like two rank 50 players or something. I wish that's still not run 50. Let's yeah. look at this one too. Archon 2. Is this a smurf? Yeah, this okay. It's, he's it's not a real Archon 2. Associated with Face It or something? I don't know. It's previous rank immortal. I don't know how he got that Archon 2 rank to his previous immortal. Must be party MMR. Oh, BBTM wants to watch, but we're in Valhalla, aren't we? To move down. Can move down for him if people are cool with that. ETM's chill. I don't know what that is. Got a cold audience, dude. Is an MMR group out. Let's look at how mid's going. Damn, Dez is struggling, it looks like. Oh, 
I don't know if this is the matchup. This guy is a Huskar game. Looks like Des is coming back now, though. He has a lot more denies. I mean, look at the HP. Yeah. Were you watching? This guy's maxing his passive, damn. I feel like if you have to max your passive, you kind of concede fully. <laughs> I think two points in pass is fine. Let's we'll see what he does. Like getting two points and dragging yeah, him off. I mean, it's three. fine, but it's like not the position you want to be in as a Husker. He's level four already. But I guess his disarm's worthless this line, so he doesn't have to worry about scaling up really. Actually, it's not like. Complete, he can disarm to like break the, the scythe. Alternatively, he could just. Or he can just click here and make this. Oh shit. Des is dead here, you know? Yeah, he is. If he misses uphill, he's not. Oh. No, he wasted a sow too. That's a yikes. Oh. That's a yikes. That was close though. It was close. Mm, it wasn't, it wasn't, it was two ticks. Backs were about to fall off. But yeah, that sucks. He's in trouble now. What's Polo doing? Not even with the nakes. They land swapped again? No, never mind. It's already done. Shit, uh oh, does is fucked up. Yeah. One death lane over. Bounty. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. It's an hour Radiant's off game. bottom tower is under attack. They need this Huskar to like overextend and get a kill on him. Like Dez isn't tilted. You have to get Dez level six and then get the Huskar last. Yeah. By exorcism. I mean, like, the way you beat Huskar mid is like a support rotates, you stun kill him, but they don't have supports that can rotate mid this game. Uh, the Nyx can rotate. He can. Yeah. Yeah. It's really hard for the Nyx to, to get a kill on the Huskar before 6. Uh, also dead. I think he's okay. He's got a call. Going on uh -oh. Polo. He spends pretty fast. Uh oh. oh. Still fine. Did they rotate it? Polo at phase boots. That scout is in trouble. He's not. He's dead. Is phase boots the new thing? No. But it. Uh, Arteezy was fine. Arteezy bought phase boots, man. In the grand finals. Yep. You have to counter the opponent's phase boots with your own phase boots. It's the only way to not get bullied. That is such bullshit on the bounces. That, I'd be mad. I don't think it makes a difference, I'd still be mad. Oh, yeah, I think he was dead either way. I guess it is the Nisha. Nisha did it too. I think it just helps your lane presence a lot. Yeah, it looks like in both these games they were they were laned off. Like... Alright, here's Terp. Eyeballing this Huskar. What do you do? Des what do you do? Stop. Polo in trouble. Calling. They're Terp diving has been pretty deep. Teleported though. in. This could be good for Dire if they can turn around. That's. That's done for six. Nope. That's I think they're gonna get the Grim though. They're gonna get the Grim Witch Doctor. Oh, maybe not even. Mm, they're gonna get no one. That oh. feels bad, man. I don't think I can wish Double centaurs. Got him. Worth it. Recall on a TP. Yeah, this, this phase is really interesting because. 
It gives yeah. Sven 2% modifier to MS, so he does zoom, and he needs armor, but the attack speed is so good for farming in the gear. I think it's... And the strength goes into your war cry. I think it's worth it for fighting here, especially because he has a Chen on his team. Otherwise, especially laning with it. Otherwise, you get stuck in traffic trying to hit things. You also, like, tread switching is also big on Sven. That's true. It's an interesting trade-off. I think the, the balance in general between phase and treads is probably the closest it's ever. Usually one is like always dominant over the other depending on the patch. This patch it's very situational. It's just pop ghosts and rotate it out. It feels bad. I really yeah, like phase. Okay. Still doesn't make it less of a feels bad man. He's farming jungle with ghosts. I really like Phase Wraith game, but a lot of people still prefer Treads on the hero. Yeah, it does need to find some way in this game. I don't know how though. He, he needs like a team fight cleanup with Exorcism. He needs just to kill on the Husker, but I don't know how they do it. He has Armlet now. Three points in the blood. If Turf can get six. Yeah. The three man gank him with the bat, maybe that's enough. Lala has BOTs. Kudo. I'm trying to like delay. I think that's what I'm trying to do. People just stack their mess on this hero and get a late bling because of the percent for fire. Scow gave 185 gold on death. Oh, that's that's bode well. They made support feeding like even less impactful in this patch, which really surprised me. I thought it was gonna go the other way, but they changed the gold loss formula. You used to always lose 50 gold on top of your net worth factor, and now that 50 gold loss is gone. So it's like, hey, it supports feed away. Uh oh. Hasted Huskar. They might be able to get this Oscar if Terp like gets on top of them when they centaur stun. The fucking centaurs got casked. Yeah. It feels awful. I forgot about that. That's actually a big... Nice check counter. This Oscar is deep, man. What the fuck? He needs to be careful. Uh... He could die. I think he <laughs> is dead. Yeah, this is exactly what we wanted. That's worth Yeah. It's not a little cocky there. Which it's a shame Des didn't there. get the kill. <laughs> he got that XP though. He jumped yeah. a few levels. Oh, that was huge. That's a lot of XP. Meanwhile, I'm life stealer though. Would have been better if Terp died first as well. Ooh. The net worth difference between Life Stealer Sven is nasty right now. If he gets like a quick radiance timing, this game might be hard for them. I think Dazzle. Oh, he's still going Yules. Apollo just needs to get Battle Fury to catch up. Is it going? Still going yeah. Echo? Yeah. Yeah, you have to get Echo on Sven. This is where you feel the the treads hurt. On this, this like phase of farming jungle on Sven. <laughs> he attacks so slow. He has a slower BAT as well. They can try to kill here. Look, it's hard. Dyer's top tower has fallen. That's the double game. Good thing his bat is very powerful right now, but he's kind of on his own up here. He's so fast, I don't think really catch him. He is fast. 414. He has 12 charges too. Does kill the Aegis? No, Husker picked it up. And Dev's gonna die for it, that's really unfortunate. Yikers. And Lala might die here. And exorcisms down. <laughs> it's like a triple whammy. Huskar still oh, no, gets Lala's aging. Fine. What if that centaur stomps? Bottom tower he got the attack. kill on Roche, he got the Aegis, he got the kill on DP, and DP lost Ghost. 
I wonder if Des is tilted. I Des is tilted. That would be pretty sad. Firefly torched. No rage though. He's so fast. Nick's stun is, I think, the hardest stun to hit in the game. Especially against the life stealers. I think hitting arrows, honestly, easier than hitting Nick's stuns. Oh yeah, by the way, Mars Spear gets that much stun time because it's just like hitting an arrow, it's just as hard. Giga Crappa. Dyer's structures are fortified. Can I kill anyone here? Bottom nope. That is rage down. I mean, I would. Yeah, last one. That's coming to the same way. That's the ninja. <laughs> firing on the <laughs> Feels bad. <laughs> oh no, out of Dan's mind. <laughs> oh, this game looks over. They got yeah. Husk Guard. I like Grim, like, salvaged that fight. His ults have been really good. They've done a good job comboing them. I think now they have Huskar Ages, they can just go high ground. I love cutting the next wave, but they still have They do have DP Ghosts. Might, might get a chance here, but it's rough. Losing to Huskar like this is just like the worst feeling in Dota. Like Huskar, Broodmother. Oh, it's so disheartening. You just like hit him with all your spells and none of it matters. It's like that game we played against Huskar. Yeah. I, I did like 20,000 damage on Windrunner in fucking 26 minutes. It just didn't matter. He just regenerated all of it. Radiance Courier has been killed. All right. First, first win for the Dire. Oh, he hit a stun. It's actually huge, wasn't that relic on it? Whoa, I man. didn't see what was on it. Oh, that's that's relic. Relic. Good. Yeah. He killed it. That's massive. Terp did. Is this? Yeah, relic on my radiant stop up three minutes. Oh shit, yeah, it was relic. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Huskar has got 10 second BKB now. It's <laughs> not he he actually could have died. Yeah, it was ages gone. Small victory. That has lasso. He might be able to lasso him. Well, he uh, can lasso him, but now he's just gonna pop BKB and. He doesn't, he doesn't have a life deal. deal. So he can still die. Wow. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. that's good. What yeah, pulled him back weird. there? Oh, it was the Bat W. I don't know. Right, right. This is like exactly what they needed. Dez is gonna heal the full here. Set back the radiance, pop the ages. Huskar was like way too cocky. Does Dez have his full yules now? BRB. I can't believe he let himself get lassoed like that. Allah has almost has blink now, I think, after this wave. Polo's going. BKV. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Doesn't Grimstroke ult and Doom go through BKV? Yes. Can you get targeted by Huskar if you're BKB'd? 
I do not believe Radiant's so. Bottom tower is under attack. Actually, no, you can't. Um, Hustar still jumps at you and attack. takes the damage, but you don't Radiant's take damage. I'm pretty sure. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's top shrine is under attack. Dyer's top shrine has fallen. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's structures are fortified. Radiant structures are fortified. I wonder if they'll fight this. Radiant are scanning. Dyer are scanning. Wait, what is this thing? What thing? Yeah, look at that. What, what milk? Thing? Yeah. I don't know about that. Seems pretty good for RF characters. Yeah. Doesn't seem amazing though. Can they catch here? It's done in three. Yules? Oh. The Yules here is healed for the result. I still think that's okay. Considering how far behind they were. And this game votes late, is it good for them? Mm. Hard to say. The EXP and gold still heavily favored Radiant, even with Dire being behind. But I'm worth I guess the gold so didn't heavily more. favor. The EXP did. Double damage. Can you win a game when the bat runner is the highest net worth here on your team? Maybe. What's he going, Hags? I think when Dez gets Hags, it would be good. He's quite a bit off, though. Grimstroke still has ult, and they have Doom. There's Crimson Guard. Radiant's top tower is under attack.
Dyer's bottom shrine is under Radiance attack. top tower has been denied. Radiant structures are fortified. Dyer's bottom shrine is under attack. We don't know that, Dan. People are, I think, theorizing that it just transfers all keystones to the same thing. That's what I was wondering, because I was like, if it's not, that means if I start on the right side of the tree, or someone starts on the left side, it's passing my gym to see what happens to the left side. Yeah. The, that's, people are guessing that it just transfers keystones to the same thing, but we don't know for sure. Because that'd be, that'd be heartbreaking if I, like, put one on in, it's like, oh shit, it's not for nothing. And all of a sudden, on the left side, inside, it's like some ultimate... Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. <laughs> Radiant are scanning. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Yo, that's the future right there. I think it's ugly. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower has fallen. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack.
Radiant structures are fortified. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower has fallen. Is it bad to get two ACs? It's not ideal. It's not great. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dealer and Huskar have AC. Yeah, it looks like if the target is killed by the ghost trigger, the ghost just immediately cancels itself. Attack speed, what phase? Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Actually, I got no creep waves. Middle tower is under attack. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Radiance bottom tower has fallen. Oh, over the Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower has fallen. Dyer's middle barracks are under attack. Oh! Dyer's middle barracks has fallen. Dyer's middle barracks has fallen. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Maybe they can hold high ground. Radiant are scanning.
Is this game on the EU server? It might be, my ping's 100. Yeah, my ping's over 100 too. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower has fallen. That make a big that mess. Make a big mess. Dyer's top barracks are under attack. Dyer's top barracks has fallen. Dyer's top barracks has fallen. Dyer's bottom barracks has fallen. Dyer's bottom barracks are under attack. Dyer's bottom barracks has fallen. The Radiant now have mega barracks. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. 